Hide one is Trevor Bolton from the Trauma Council and Associates. I know that the TCA is not doing uh, other videos besides uh, like hide and seek and things like that, but you know what? Um, I thought it would be fit since we're not really doing anything at the moment when it comes to uh, videos. I thought it would be uh, fitting to actually do a gameplay of Minecraft uh, as an individual to show you uh, what how to play Minecraft and what Minecraft really is. So anyway, um, this is the main screen of Minecraft. Once you purchase it online, which is I think $27 or whatever it is, um, you'll be able to actually sign in and be able to pay, I mean play, the full version. I remember playing the, sync, the, the trial version, it was always funny because it had to beat time and stuff. But anyway, I want to name this world... Ugh, I didn't even... Okay. I'm going to name this world... Earth, since we're just going to be really basic with it. Um, you can choose hardcore mode, creative mode, or survival mode. We're going to do survival mode just for this. More world options. We're going to put in a seed. We'll try that later. Uh, bonus chest, obviously. Loud sheets. Uh, no. Default world will be de default. Large biomes is just large, larger biomes. So I'm just going to do default. I'm going to put trumpet council in there and see what happens. Okay. Done. And we'll play Create New World. Oop, my bad. Uh, sometimes the seed really doesn't generate based on what it is. I mean, I don't know how those seeds work, but it's pretty cool. Alright, so I started in underwater. And here we go. Alright, there should be a bonus chest around here somewhere. I asked for it to do a bonus chest. I don't know why it... Where is my bonus chest? Where? The bonus chest. Is it underwater? Great, they're gonna actually make me look for it. Interesting. Alright, so I'm just gonna go ahead and do like a walkthrough type thing. This will be like an extended day thing. Alright, so when you pick your world, you'll end up either spawning in a weird place or things like that. If you did the chest one, you'll be able to find a chest randomly. There are usually uh, torches around, but sometimes there's not. So let me open and see what I got. Okay, got some wood. Got some apples, a stick, and some wooden, some wooden pickaxes. I'm going to take the chest just in case. Might need it later. I don't like the jungle biome, so I'm going to actually move from the jungle biome. Unless you guys want me to stay in the jungle biome. This is a very interesting seed. I just don't know if it's legit. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to go to the desert. The desert biome is pretty basic. Uh, it's a bunch of sand. Sometimes you might find a hidden place or things like that, which is cool. Uh, there's cacti. Not, not much I can say about that. The cool thing about it is you just uh, knock off the bottom of it. Nothing falls. Uh, you can't stack one next to it, and it has to always be on sand for some reason. Because it's a desert. Yeah, yeah, I know. Alright, 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 alright. Oop! All right, I see the swamp biome. Let's see if I can get over there. So there are different biomes. There's the uh, jungle. There's the f uh, there's the snow one, snow biome I think. And there's the jungle one. I already said jungle, didn't I? And there's a the swamp one. It's pretty basic. The object of Minecraft is not really, you know, defined. But, um, if you are wondering, everything is in blocks, I do know that. That is the, that is how Minecraft is made. I don't think it's just some crappy graphics. These are actually pretty ingenious. Uh, it teaches people about, you know, building things. Oh, but you, you, you don't care about it. Alright, I'm gonna knock down a tree since, you know, it can easily do it. Now I know this defies physics right here, but in the Hexit one, you can actually knock it all down, which is pretty cool. 
Also, the difference between vanilla, which is this, this is vanilla, vanilla, hex it, and tech it, is the fact that uh, the technical launcher, or the tech it, whatever, company type thing, uh, the people uh, put a lot of mods into it. Basically, it's still using the same Minecraft experience, except tweaking it to where you could like launch missiles into the air and things like that. Alright, so rule number one on Minecraft is the fact that you can do uh, cut down trees like this. It's a lot different than uh, exit. So I'm going to show you what you do. You go to a tree, either with a, well, at this point, <laughs> with your fist or hand, and you somehow can do this. You start from the bottom and you work your way up. Pretty self explanatory You keep going. Yes, my child, you keep going. You keep going until you go to the top. And when you can't go anymore, you just go away. So now I can see the sky. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. What happens is that uh, the leaves will realize that there is no core. So what happens is it'll drop these seeds. And what these seeds are, they're called saplings. You just place them down. You can only guess what they do. They make more trees. Correct. Since this is the swamp biome, they're going to get these weird vine things. You can get those later in the game. I'll show you how. If I can. Alright, so that's pretty self-explanatory. I'm actually going to take this back. I'm going to keep exploring. Uh, there are all, there are mods, like Gary's mod, and, um, oh gosh, what is the, Ray's minimap. Um, I haven't really used Ray's minimap in a while, because I've been focusing on Hexit, which already has a map with it. This is actually the first time I've played regular in a while, and it's, it's, it's been a while. These are pigs, by the way. Pigs are nice. They're your friends. They are your friends. Hello, little pig. Hello. It, it is good to see you. Stop looking at my crotch area. Um, you can only guess what you can get from pigs. You get, um, pork. But if it's against your religion, I advise not killing them. Because they're pure, right? They're unpure. They're unpure, that's right. So, I, I usually start out with just getting wood. Now, this is kind of a boring part of the game, but once you get all the wood, you should be fine. I just leave. Exploring, exploring. The reason why mods are good is because it's no longer like this. It's no longer just this. And what I mean by this is boringness. Can it? You can't, like, do great things. Okay, this is sugarcane. I'll show you what that is in a few seconds. I'm trying to find a good area to make a house. I usually pick the forest because I'm a noob. <laughs> no, not really. The, I mean, the, uh, just the... Yeah, I think it's called the forest, yeah. Oh, let me make sure I got... It. Okay, so difficulty's on the easy. Um, what is that? I have no idea. Uh, okay. Since my computer is already used to the <clears throat> vanilla Minecraft and it's been working on like Hexen and stuff, it's actually <laughs> prepared itself to re ri uh, do regular Minecraft. So this is the fancy version of it. Not fancy. At all. All fancy does is make the leaves look like leaves. So it looks kind of nice, I guess. Ah, I'm lost. Great. Oh, and it makes the things look awesome. You didn't see a difference? I'll show you. I will show you. Okay, you notice that the trees switched back. The grass is a little weird looking. I'm gonna put this back. Oh, wait. 
And I'll show you how to use the G G right now. Okay. Then I hit it. See, it's not fancy looking. It doesn't even spin. Your name. So I'm gonna go back because that's awesome. Um, smooth lining. Always put it at maximum unless you're not really doing good performance. Ooh, let's do bobbing. Maximum. Oh. Let's make this thing lag. Kidding. Kidding. It's not gonna lag. Look at the clouds, by the way. Isn't that awesome? Sweet. Okay. Obviously, I'm now bobbing, which is probably distracting for you. But you know what? You're actually right. <laughs> if you bobbing, let's turn that off. Alright, well, I guess this is a perfect place to make a house because it's next to the water. Alright, so I'm going to hereby declare that this little block right here block will be the starting point of my house. So how you do this is you just get your wood. It's your wood. Put in your crafting thing right here. <gasps> and look, oak wood planks. What you do is you hold shift and then you click. And you should get all the wood that you just did. Start with the basic house. You make it two. Well, that's what a noob would do, but I'm not done with my house. This is the frame. And since everything's in block form, I try to make things unblockified. Do things like that. But it's still going to be a block, which is weird. Because you can't make a circle. You can. Yes, you can. And it's going to start small at first, and that's, that's understandable. One, two, two, one, two, and I think that was it. Okay, so let's go back here. In front of the house, I don't know where that's going to be, so let's just go ahead and do this. I'm getting the frame of it because I know I don't have enough wood. All right, it's going to be the frame of it, of the middle part. Uh, this is this house is actually going to expand way more than what it is now. But that's, that's usually what I do a house out of. I actually should do the... Ah, crap, I clicked myself in. I actually should do like a. Um. Uh. Um, uh what was I about to say? I have no idea what I was about to say. That's weird. All right, we'll put my chest here. Put some lights up. That I got from default, whatever. Because I'm an awesome player. And put all this in here because I don't need it at the moment. Hmm. Seat. Alright, so we're going to start with a basic crafting table. This is where the game gets awesome. Alright, so here's a crafting table. It's just four wood planks just like this. And then it's going to get complicated because that was a 2x2 two two square and now it's going to be a 3x3 three three square. Because you can make multiple things with it. Alright, so the basic thing we need to start off with is we need to add another stick because I don't have enough sticks. We're going to do that, and I think we should make a sword. So a sword basically resembles this. You have two wood planks up here, and then the wood stick. And there's your sword. So just in case, because I think it's about to get dark. Ooh, that's pretty. 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 It's going to get dark, so I'm going to get some monsters coming up at me in a second. So, if you see me screaming like a little baby, that's probably because I'm about to die. I'm also starving. Need to raise animals. Good thing there's some pigs over there. Oh, hello. This is a skeleton, everyone. You gotta have skill with these guys. These guys are overpowered. Oh, the graphics make it look cool. And this is a slime. They're kind of pathetic. Except when they do that. Ah! See, look how cool that graphic is. It's awesome. And this is a zombie. Zombies, you should know what they are. They're like us. We, the people, in order to farm a my perfect game. I'm gonna make my... mine. <gasps> That's a creeper, everyone. And that sound? from that guy.
They scare the crap out of This new series on Trumpet Lord playing vanilla Minecraft was brought to you by the Black Team, as well as the Trumpet Council and Associates. Support us today.